I will see if well, that's not right, right in front of me. Is it working now? So it's working now. That is weird though. No, for some reason the bitrate to Twitch, and I mean on their site, was red. OBS was fine. There was nothing wrong with OBS. It was the connection between the restream and Twitch. OBS was fine. OBS was pushing it out just fine. I had no issue. But I think it was the connection between my the restream. I actually got rid of it for now. So I'm not I'm not I'm not live streaming to YouTube right right now, so I'm not really worried about it then. Yeah, it probably, probably, probably does. No, that's what happened. I think it was the connection between Restream.io and um, YouTube and Twitch. Okay, whatever. Alright, let's continue. Last time we left off, we left off in a moment like this. We asked for the St. Brennan. Um, they told us about it. I'll even just... That statue represents your local there saint. You what do you mean by local? Exactly. You wouldn't be looking down at us like all townspeople do. Mm -hmm. Saint Brendan. He protected whalers and fishermen like us. Until those assholes defaced him. Okay, so, so is this where you live? Peculiar house. Yeah, that's where we live. Our boat. Okay. It's not because it doesn't float anymore that we're going to abandon it. I think they're drunk. Isn't it a bit early for alcohol? We got nothing better to do anyway. There's not much work around here. Fitzroy gives us a few chores every now and again, but since the whaling station shut down, ain't a lot of jobs left around here. So we drink. Cool. Yeah, we got him. The two guys behind you. What are they guarding? I don't know. The bootleggers. Scum. They're protecting their territory. From whom, I wonder? I don't know who they're trying to protect. They really don't have a choice anyway. They're more scared of cat than an attack by drunken sailors. Really? If only they would kill each other. First off, who is, is cat? it cat who's shaking down Captain Fitzroy? Oh, hold on, hold on just a minute. We didn't tell you a thing. Yeah, you did. Nothing at all. You sure? Okay. I've taken enough of your time. We'll see you later. See you later, man. Hey, dude, just go um, attack these idiots. Let's, also, let's go talk to them. I kind of know which way to go already because it's already showing me. It's right here. Oh, you could tell me. No, if see it right here? Out, I'll have serious that's telling me where to go. It is start, it's already Five telling me. It's a shining light through there. It's telling me. Not even. But well, let's go talk to them. No idea. You better keep it shut. What's with you wandering around here like a hungry dog? We saw you talking to the two soaps. Go die of thirst, a lot of you. It'll stink less. Hmm. I could lie. But I don't think they'll believe me because eventually they will they will contact her. So, yeah. I've got to enter the Hawkins warehouse. I guess it's going to be complicated. No, it's very simple in fact. Fuck off. I don't give a damn about your racket. I just want to get into this warehouse. And we don't give a damn about you. Wow. Whatever your reason for wanting inside, there's nothing we can do for you. Okay. So who are you? Are you stupid or are you doing it on purpose? No, I'm not Everybody stupid. Everybody knows us on dark water. Okay, who are you? I've just arrived. Let's just say we're standing guard for the owner of the site. And we let no one enter her property. <laughs> Is it you? What happened to the statue of St. Brendan? Dreadful. What makes you think we did it? We're bootleggers, not savages. Who do you think defaced the statue? What do I know? They could have done it by themselves. Probably. The sailors. Who else, in your opinion? And who's interested? Hmm. Cat. 
She's your boss. What? You listen through keyholes. Oh, yeah. She's the boss, yeah. She says who goes in or not. Shut up, you dummy. You wanted to know that you also talk too much. Wow. She must be quite intimidating if she can make two men like you tremble. Ooh. <laughs> she redid the smile at the last one who wanted to get in. I hope you had a good dentist. No, no, you don't understand. She really cut him a new smile. But he only smiles with the left cheek. <laughs> okay. Oh, should I? You don't know. I bid you, gentlemen. I don't want to lie. I'm gonna. I'm gonna be a little fun. See you guys. See you guys later. Bye. See you later. Bye, guys. You told him not to not to see me walk through here. How could you be dumb enough to leave the entrance to the warehouses unguarded? Keep your voice down. Why not go and shout at the cat while you're at it? I don't want to end up with oh. a little knife under my throat. Ew. It's a stiletto, you idiot. And with that smell on your breath, I don't give you much chance anyway. Ooh. Let's go see cat. And I think I know where she's at. Who, who, who is this? Where do you think you're going? Um. Who are these others so interested in the warehouse? And why would I tell you? I'd like to know more about the Hawkins case. I don't think so. I thought that the Hawkins case had been closed. That's true. So what are you doing on guard duty in front of this warehouse? Ooh. <laughs> Who's asking the questions here, the cop or the tourist? Um, the tourist, apparently. What more can you say about the death of the Hawkins family? Not much more than what everyone knows. I wasn't on the case. Okay. They were all burnt to death, right? Up at their place. The whole mansion went up in flames. Don't get it into your head to go wandering around up there. It's dangerous. Okay. What do you mean by that? The only one left there is old Silas. And the accident has affected him badly. Okay. He can be unpredictable. Gotcha. Especially if a stranger starts poking around the property. Is he a danger to the public? No, he's in his own home. Really? Do yourself a favor. Leave him well alone. Okay. But we still gotta, we still gotta get in the warehouse, y'all. We gotta go talk to, um... Hmm. Here we go. So first, we gotta go do this, okay? In the water, you shysters. You're crazy. Oh, they're gone. Okay. Hey, baby doll. Left. My God. You what? Another break? I told you to beat it. Really? Aren't you Kate? Girl? I told you to beat it. Girl, I should have talked to them first. Fudge me. <sighs> Fine. I'm gonna go right this way. We can't go that way. We can't go that way. We gotta go this way. Cthulhu gonna be hot in my boo hole. Oh, who's this? It's back here, but I know. Who, who, who's this first? You saw what happened with those sailors. Don't hang around here unless you want trouble with the bootleggers. This warehouse looks abandoned. Why does it interest them so much? Yeah. No doubt a question of territory, but I ain't asking. Okay. If you want to know more, go ask the captain. Good. Thank you. I've seen the kind of messages their boss sends. You're not scared of her. Of course I am. Everyone's scared of that woman. Okay. She's not interested in small fry like me. You, on the other hand, nose around too much, you'll have dealings with her. Okay. Good to know, good to I know. I shall take my leave. Yeah. Let's 
So spy knives, Elijah's well, second knives are close range. It looks like there's a way in under this grate. Okay. So there is back. So how do I get up top to Oh. Cool. I don't know that I don't know how to use it. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, what's this? A whale vertebra. If the newspaper clipping in the bar is true, this bone is a real fossil. Good to know. There's something clo close by. Oh, it's this. So I'm wondering. Uh, it's basically your right now your your test to find out what happened to the Hawkins family that got basically flamboyant. Oh, there, 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 there it is. That somehow got a, ha a, ha a house fire happened. That's Hawking up to an accident. Even the fact that that they're questioning about her. I was like, I'll leave you with Jay. Here we go, please. You're looking into their murder. Charles Hawkins, Sir Hawkins, and Simon Haw Haw Hawkins. Not murder, deaths. Because this guy right here, Stephen Webster, comes and hires you. And you have to sort of accept, accept the case, because if you don't, you lose your license and you get kicked out. So you're, you're done with that. So you have to do it. So you're looking into, into their supposed deaths. Because he's more focused on the fact that she was having, I guess, visions, premonitions about moments. Her art was sort of, I guess, sketchy. Kind of, uh, let me see, places of cults. This was one of her artworks right here. Oh, thank you for the host, Mark. Thank you for the host. But um, but yeah, this one of her art, she's basically an in, in, intuitive and visionary artist for some, overpriced and positive for others. Sir Huggins leaves. Nobody different. It's mysterious and reserved. Painting off of strange images, Basically, it's you're looking into Cthulhu. You're looking into the island of where they died at. Everything's going to come to pass. That you're looking into what got them killed. So, yeah. That's basically how this plays out. And every time I see that little green circle on the bottom left, it explains the fact that, hey, guess what? There's, um... I could use this old winch to lift the grating. But it's been completely taken to bits. There must be some spare parts amid all this clutter. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, I mean, that's why I was down here. That's why this is over here. Okay. Can I, can I take it? Can't. Take it. it should be possible to mount this cogwheel on the winch. Okay. Um. Oh, handle. Handle. I can't, can't, I can't, 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 can't get that. So right now we're trying to get into the warehouse because it's like the last main, one of the clues was, um, was right here. Nope, here. One of the clues for chapter one, I'm sorry. And one of the clues right here, it mentions a warehouse 36. Which is why we're trying to get into the warehouse. Apparently this is where that picture was sent from. Okay, okay, I'll say. Fine, let's get back upstairs and see what it does. I'm pretty sure. I hope I'm not gonna do it bit by bit. If I can do it bit by bit, I'm gonna be a little upset. My cargo. So we need more. Okay, so now we need the. I probably could have picked it all up, but I didn't find the right one. Okay. Um. It's right here. Okay, 
I don't know what the heck I'm even doing. Like, it's somewhere in this area, but where? Oh, come on, really? It had to be a level with that cog roll on it. You mother this handle will be perfect for the winch. That is bull crap. That is a load of hogwash. Okay. Now what? Okay, what is the one missing now? I thought, all, I thought that's all I needed, but apparently I didn't. <sighs> oh, this is... Um, oh, a ratchet device. Exactly what I need. I just finalized it because it made that noise. Looks like everything is in its place. All I have to do is turn this handle. So yeah, apparently I know how this thing plays out. It plays out like L.A. Noir does, which is kind of interesting because I might want to play that next after I do this. Oh, it's poison gas. <coughs> yep, I'm stoned. Apparently what I'm getting stoned, y'all. What's this? <coughs> Smoke. It's coming from this oil. Yeah, for what I reason? I hope it's not toxic. <coughs> I don't know. You're, you're kind of breathing kind of bad, but okay. <coughs> I hope it's... Nothing that way. <coughs> well, that might be the next thing I do after I do this game, then it'd be kind of fun to... Continue an investigatory moment. Be able to experience and try to figure people out. I'm going to love the one that. Oh. What is that? Hey. Who brought the water monster? To oh, mother. Okay, who brought the company? Who brought the company, people? I don't know why I'm going to bring company. I don't know why I'm, I'm a little... It's fine. <laughs> yeah, I guess so, man. Okay. Oh, no, no worries. So I'm going to finish right when I get... Oh, what the... This is primitive. Yeah. What about it? You say it's primitive, but what about it? I always say it's primitive. Yeah, it's primitive. For what reason? Oh, there it is. Oh, this place stinks. Okay, cool. New, new what is the connection? Okay, we're gonna... We're gonna, we're gonna... we're gonna up that. No, I'm not. Pick it up. We're gonna up... This. I kinda want that. Yeah, we're 
between this place and the Sarah Hawkins case. What happened here? Interesting. So somebody punched it. Okay. I got you. These painkillers were prescribed three months ago. Okay. Someone has been taking them since the time of the Hawkins' death. It smells as bad as it looks. Yeah, and all right, but it probably tastes great too, right? Le Petit Parisian. Who might keep a news clipping about Sarah Hawkins? Intriguing. Someone treasures this crumpled picture to the point of sleeping with it. Oh! Nice. Is this one of Sarah Hawkins' paintings? Is that it? I think it's the other thing, right? Let's go. That's weird. I guess we're going to announce this tour at it. We're gonna do some Pierce himself. We're gonna up the lot psych psychology. Go on. Twitch, please. What's going on with Twitch this time? So far, it doesn't seem to be going crazy for me yet. What the heck? You know what this game reminds me of? At least with with the lighter command. Um, game called Hector. Uh, someone has settled in here, and whoever it is has something to tell me about the Hawkins case. Is there anyone in there? Yo, don't move, Detective Pierce. I told you to stay away from this warehouse. Ah, uh, why would I do that? Hmm. Wound up? You mean messed up? No. We don't take no lessons from the likes of you. Why? We do our job carefully and fairly. No stone was left unturned. Really? Can you explain what this painting is doing here? This strange portrait. Wait, I know it. It was in the Hawkins mansion when we came to investigate the fire. So you confirm that it was removed from the crime scene? Interesting. I'd like to go and see the mansion now. Of course. You want to go back along his trail? <sighs> I'd like to understand how this painting made it to here. Come on. My car is parked down the way. Let's go! Andrews, would you please shut the door? Open your eyes, damn it. This guy went right under your nose. <laughs> damn it. Her again. Kay. This case has nothing to do with you, Baker. Clear the passage Baker. or I'll shut you up for obstruction. Officer Bradley, you've finally grown a pair. Too bad you're too fat to see them down there. He ain't fat. Who are you? Come on, keep the smile. You don't want to force me to widen it. Okay, I get it. Can we go to the mansion now? Who the hell are you? What were you doing on my turf? I've got my eye on you. We'll meet again. Okay, baby, come on. I'll take you out, mother. Is it far, this mansion? Look behind you, at the top of the ridge. Oh, wow. You see the building? That's the Hawkins Mansion. Come on, we got well, some driving to do. Well, who we'll lived up there, y'all? Okay. <clears throat> Pierce managed to get to the warehouse. The place, the 
thought to be abandoned revealed some surprise signs of recent occupation, as well as clearly partly charred painting. I want to interrupt it in his searching of office. Bradley Pierce convinced him to join the location. The police officer is willing to drive the How can you have to do? Oh, great, oh, great, oh. Who is panting like he just got on? Here we are, Hawkins Mansion. Really? Yeah, I did see the thing with the twenty, the, about the eleventh year. The place ah. has been abandoned since the fire. There's only old Winchester in his hut. Huh? Can I move on? I don't believe the fire is the only reason this house is in such a state. It's a very old building, you know? Yeah. Its foundations would probably date from the arrival of the first settlers. Really? Huh. It's really that old. Come on, let's leave the stories of the dead alone. They've nothing to do with your case anyhow. Let's go up there. Unless you still have questions. I do. Your partner, Andrews, warned me against him. You managed to get something out of that bomb? I'll end up asking you for advice. I know. He talks too much. He inferred that old Silas was slightly unhinged. That's not far off the mark, I suppose. But kind of unfair at the same time. Yeah. You know, Silas Winchester has been working for the Hawkins family as far back as I can remember. Really? Charles was like a son to him. The day of the fire... He lost his whole family. Wow. He's got nowhere to go. And, as you'll see, in a way, he's still watching over them. Is there anything else you want to ask me? Yeah. Or do you want to go up there? I want to ask more questions. I prefer to be prepared if there's going to be trouble. Oh, that's still good. Definitely Wise exciting. Attitude. But apart from old Silas and some rotten floorboards, yeah. there's nothing to worry about. Okay. Could he be a problem? Strictly speaking, he ain't dangerous. But since the tragedy, he's been a little touched. Though, he's a remarkably sturdy man, given his age. Really? A true force of nature. A sad old man doesn't worry me. Gee, if you don't want to listen to my advice, we might as well go. Right? Okay, I'm listening, I'm listening. You're the one who looked after the Hawkins case. Don't think I was trying to hide it. It's just that this discovery shakes my convictions. Well, no. That's why you're so keen to find you out missed. who removed the painting from Because you man. missed something. Yes. If something escaped us, or if there's been a law enforcement error, then it's up to the police to make good its mistake. Yeah. Anything else? Um. Night falls quickly here, and I want to be able to see when we arrive. I'll go with you, if only to reassure Silas. That's good. Oh, yeah, too. Let's go. Why not? You can help. Right. Let's go. Let's go, y'all. Go! Let's go! Oh, that was some weird cameras. Hey, buddy. The thing is, I love, I love when she says that he was fat, but he's not fat. If that's your terminology for, for fat, then. She didn't get her eyes cut. It's just. Bradley was right. This place is much <laughs> older than I imagined. <laughs> he grew, she's like, she, she's like, you, you grew up here. Too bad you can't sit because, because you're fat. I'm like, what? Uh, the flowers on Sarah Hawkins' grave are fresh. Hmm. Probably from what's his name? 
Silas. Charles Hawkins' grave. Who could have done this? I don't know. I told you. Silas Winchester is still watching over the Hawkins family. I must say, it's pretty gloomy. Yeah. So, detective. Does this place inspire any thoughts? Why were they buried here? I was given to believe that it was Charles Hawkins' wish. Strange idea. I imagine Webster wasn't too pleased. Mrs. Hawkins' father? It's said that he's devastated. Yeah, he is. Hmm. Let's go to the mansion. I think I still Please do. give me a minute. I didn't expect to set foot back here after Poor kid. What kind of deranged individual Poor kid. a sanctuary and steal a burnt painting? I don't see Silas doing such dude, a thing. Dude, I was get you Let probably alone wanted allowing to sleep it. With her. You Even wanted to sleep with her. You wanted that. to sleep with her, Lord, okay? You freak. Have pity on this poor family. You wanted to spank that all the time. You wanted to hit that harder than <laughs> I know it is. He's still standing. Okay, can I can we get going? Ready? You, you ready? You, you ready to go? Let's go. Are you, are you coming, buddy? I'm gonna leave him. Oh, to get him saved. Okay, there's no way through the front entrance because the doors are, blo bo are boarded off. I'll have to find another entrance. Yep. Shut up, crow! Ah! Can, can he jump this? Boo Boo can't jump. Hello? We have to find this entrance is still in use. Okay, cutting. Whoa! Whoa! You are trying to force the door, you nosy prick! Easy, sir, all right? Put down the axe. You know what we do with rubble like you? We gut them. Dump them into the ocean. I like it. I like it. You're Mr. Winchester. Lower that axe. And let's talk calmly. I'll show you how we have it out on dark water. Sarah Hawkins' father sent me here to investigate the death of his daughter. Webster, huh? I understand how he feels. But me? I want the dead to rest in peace. Okay. And that means kicking the ass of gumshoes like you. I... Why would you not want me to help understand what happened here? I've got nothing to hide. Tell me what you're doing here. There's no be. baloney. The police oh. report describes a domestic accident. But Stephen Webster has several reasons to believe that this may not be the case. Webster is as stubborn as an old mule. He is. And I did tell him that we should let the dead rest in peace. He wants to restore the reputation of his daughter. I just need to see where the fire started. The mansion isn't safe. You would break your neck as sure as you're trying my patience right now. Really? That's why you barricaded the entrance. That's right. And this door? It's locked. And I make sure it stays that way. Hmm. Want to get rid of me? The sooner I carry out my investigation, the sooner I wrap up the case and return to Boston. After which, you'll never hear of me again. Huh. I like the sound of that. There we go. But I have a better idea. You leave right now, and you never come back. Silas! Pierce! You got 
Lord's name, what are you doing? Officer Bradley, this hood was trying to break into the mansion. Do something, Bradley. Or this story will have a nasty ending. Yep. I vouch for him, Silas. He's working with us. We have reason to believe that someone entered the mansion and stole some paintings. Impossible. I would have seen it. Better safe than sorry. Now let us in. I promise to keep an eye on this one. <laughs> okay, then. I'll leave the key with you. You could have told me that earlier, Sonny. Let's see what more I can learn from this mansion. Well, I don't know. Was, was he even the option, or was that just being rushed? I think I was, I think I was being, being rushed. Well... After. Let's take a look inside. I'm with you. Come on, let's go. Holy man! Pierce the Alps of Bradley explored the gardens of the Hawkins Mansion. The family lies in the graveyard of the property, guarded by Silas Winchester. The old caretaker, still faithful to his employers, keeps watch on the place armed with his axe. Pierce and Bradley man to calm him down and finally get hold of the key to the Hawkins Mansion. They entered the building looking for the scene of the fire. Ooh. I have no idea where that one came from, but hey, I'm doing it right now. Let's do it. Follow me. I know the place. Who left this light on? I have no idea. Hey, where you going, rat man? I'm going to kill that rat like a mother. Mm -hmm. The rat went all the time. Everybody good the last day. supper of the Hawkins. Oh, my God. What does this tell me? Yeah, we're gonna we'll sit back. What's up, Mr. Bomb Pip? How you doing, my friend, Mr. Bomb Pip? How you doing? We are here today. We are gonna do great things, man. Great things. Okay, I'm back in the. Oh, what's this? What kind of meat is this? What is going on here? What the? F what is? This? I was get the. I'm gonna check that away. Get the chat away. Look like a squid to me. Look like a bit of a squid thing to me. I have no idea. This place is for the head of the family, Charles Hawkins. What happened, man? What's up, me? How you doing, everybody? Okay, look, what's this? The boy was probably here. Smashed his plate on the floor. But where is she at? Sarah Hawkins didn't eat. Was it because of the meat or something else? Oh, maybe she wasn't even there. Something happened at this table. An argument? Maybe. Hmm. Hmm. But apparently, we got the power here to do more than what we here. Daydreaming again. Working, officer. This dinner table tells us a lot about the Hawkins family life. Oh, right. Well, we don't have all day. Well, it's seen gonna find a way to do it. Gonna be something great now. Sit back right now and then. Huh. This is how I'm gonna find a way. Well, I just managed to bring the fire under control. It's already too late for the Hawkins. Let's see if I can find something the cops missed. What's this? Was Charles Hawkins some kind of explorer? Maybe. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Too much rubble. I'll find an easier way. Yeah, I kind of figured that. What's with the oil? Here you go, ready? Go! We're going into the world! If the painting I found on the docks really came from here, how come it didn't burn? I'm going to see it back right now. Too lazy to walk right over. The child's corpse left a trace. Where are the others? They had a fight. Why? Did Sarah Hawkins lose one of her shoes? How? Hmm. 
This is so cool though. I'm sorry, but this is so interesting. What's this bottle? Bottle, 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 bottle. Charles Hawkins a heavy drinker. And the clock. Did it stop at the time of the fire? Or Did someone escape the fire? Did someone? Everybody, send me your verdicts. What happened? Blood. No, no, don't, don't tell me because this life you... was thrown. This was no accident. Go sit back right now. This was a fight. Oh. You remind me. Someone fell here. Oh yeah. Gonna find them. A desperate attempt to flee. Huh. I love that walk animation. It's weird. Uh oh. Huh. Gonna hold a ladder right oh, now. Boy. So, detective, what do you make of it? Okay, it's official. This botched the investigation. The clues don't match. Well, I was like, okay, first off, let's. I'm gonna discuss each one of these fully. Okay, my hair needs a poof, but you can't see it. Right, right, right. right the, the police botched the investigation. I don't want to flat out tell him that. That's been rude. Um, but. So yeah, I don't wanna. Oh, I didn't even know that. Okay, nah, but um, okay. The clues don't match. Or should I say the fire was an accident? Much of this evidence simply contradicts the investigation's findings. Really? Tell me about it. Someone had too much to drink. I found a bottle of whiskey. Empty. Well, that must have been a loss for you. No glass. I suspect one of them drank heavily to calm down. Probably. Charles, most probably. That's pretty thin. Who says that bottle hadn't been there for a while? Okay. Okay. I can tell where young Simon was, but not his parents. Where were their bodies found? I can't help you on that one. Charles and Sarah's bodies had already been carried away when I got here. Without your authorization? By whom? By whom? Marshall, Andrews, Chief West. We never deal with cases like that, you know. So, well. It would seem at least one person fled the crime scene. What'd you say? That mark on the door. Someone's hand slid down. The left side has no mark. The door was open and that someone left. For God's sake. I mean, if it's Charles or Sarah, they wouldn't have left their son. They um, would rather die in the flames as a family instead of calling for help? I don't buy it. Oh, yeah? And? I was under the impression the fire started around midnight. Yes, at Silas banged on our door around 1 a.m. Poor devil ran so hard he was almost belching his lungs out. This clock burned before 10 p.m. That's impossible. What you imply? Silas never would have hurt the Hawkins family. Besides, Dr. Fuller confirmed the Arab death in his report. Okay. Your clock must have already have stopped. Well, who's Dr. Who's Fuller? A brilliant surgeon and a friend of the family. I'm sure he took the matter to heart. Okay. So, excuse me if I value his opinion over yours. So be it. Let's move on. I see the fire was... I suspect this lamp caused the fire. That's what the investigation suggested, too. But does your report mention the bloodstains? 
The lamp didn't fall. It was thrown at someone. For heaven's sakes, no. The report doesn't mention that. Oh. But a fire might. I firmly believe this fire was more than just an accident. Uh oh. <laughs> What's your theory? I don't know. Or, or if they're. Or, or what we saw, they were, they were fighting. But the thing about it is, though, I don't know. Oh, this is so cool. I was like, let's look back at all the options real quick. Let's truly look back and understand where we got to this point. We, well, we know that they could have been fighting. We know the fact that, I don't know about being an arson, because unless the third, unless the person that, that, that escaped got out. Hmm. Oh, this is so... Mm, I'm loving this. Oh, my. Uh, okay, well, well, we know for a fact this. I think the Hawkins couple got into a fight. You sure of that? There's only one way to be sure. How? Wait a minute, how? I just ask that you don't disturb anything. If Chief West found out about what we're doing, I'd be in serious trouble. Probably, sir. This door is locked. Oh crap, Sherlock, is it locked? Now I got a medicine upgrade. Okay, that's cool. These bandages are covered in dried blood. The same bandages that I saw in the warehouse on the docks. And given the blood stains, I'd also say that it's the same person. It's blocked off here. What's this? The lyrics of the drunken sailor, the sea shanty. Huh. An original edition of Mary Shelley's Frankenstein. Really? Dated 1818. Nice, an original. Okay. What was that for? Hmm. Moby Dick, Melville's classic. The epic battle between man and whale. Mandatory reading for any whaler, I guess. Yeah, pretty much. I guess we're picking it up. Um, this piano is in disrepair. Looks like the Hawkins kept it more for decoration than for music. Are you sure? Oh yeah, well, I forgot it's in disrepair. Not before the fire. This place was falling apart long before the fire. So, oh, what's this? A book on the first inhabitants of the island. It seems they got here around the 14th century. Yeah, I know. You're not really looking at the book. You're looking at the spine of the book. So, ooh, what's here? Another knife. The easy way out. There's something disturbing about this painting. There's something disturbing about this painting. Okay. 20,000 leagues under the sea. Another story about the mysteries of the deep. Okay, now we're, now we're starting to go into moments of the deep. Okay. Okay. What's the story about the painting? A book painting? on hunting whales. The island's staple diet last century. Dark water history. <clears throat> really? This place was settled back in 1692 by two families that seceded from the New England colonies. Really? 
It's good to know. Holy crap. <gasps> What's this? What's it? No, 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 no. There's a reason for this being lit out. I don't know why. <sighs> Greek mythology. You got it. Hecate, goddess of the dead, daughter of Tartarus, and mother of Scylla. Okay. What could Sarah have done to make this person threaten to call the police? Just sir, as you know, I've always told you and your family in high respect. Unfortunately, I can no longer continue to close my eyes on the behavior of your wife. Last week, she, again, terrified my client clientele. I know that she means no harm, but you should place her in the care of Dr. Fuller. He alone seems... Guys, can you can you stop with the musical atonement behind me? I don't care about that. Don't don't mess with me, okay? I'm trying to read his note. Makes me laugh. And these in these if these numbers were, were to reoccur, believe me that although it would feel like torture, I would be able to Oh, oh wow. What the flip happened? Ah uh, what? What the f If something pops, I'm screwing, I'm screwing, I'm screwing the little girl. I'm sorry. Let's increase my, my, my investigation, I believe. Right, let's go. Let's, let's upgrade my head. Oh, wow, okay. There's something here. Right there. Oh, wow. What will her room reveal about her? I don't know. Hmm. She's foreseeing C C C Cthulhu. Key? Perfect. What? Guys, guys, we're bringing in their call. Oh, fuzz me. Guys, I'm scared. This ledger lists all of the paintings Sarah Hawkins sold. Wow. They weren't cheap. Especially back then. God, Lee. They were rolling in a little bit. It seems the last one was given for free to a Francis Sanders. I wonder why. I don't know. Sarah Hawkins' agent was getting worried. It seems she wasn't giving any signs of life. My very dear Sarah, ever since you left to bury yourself away on the Lost Island, your art has been attracting increasing numbers of collectors. I beg you to send me some new, new penny, the last one so somber and strange, and moving as no one, as no as no other. Penny Cabot. I still ain't at the premium price. Your percent of these most recent sales is attached. Do not for, for, forget your friend, who was the first to recognize your genius and display it on the. Oh, wow. What was that? Was Sarah Hawkins interested in the occult? What was she trying to achieve? No, no forget. She could... What the... I had to keep key to that room? Oh, no. Bradley? Hey. Is that you? Guys? Guys, do I have to go? Hello? 
What's with the claw marks? You're not worried about the claw marks? Is anyone there? Your mama is. <laughs> uh, I don't like this. Dies. Oh, they're not claw marks, or they paint marks. Uh oh. Uh, what's under the. What's under the tar? Oh my god. She foresaw me being here. Get away, come on. Bradley, did you see which way he went? Who? I didn't see anyone. I just heard some noise. Are you all right? A man was hiding on the upper level. He ran when he saw me. He can't be far. Okay, so we gotta investigate now. I'll cover you. This door was closed earlier. Where did he go? It looks like an old seaway map. Uh huh. So basically, you just saw some random idiot who ended up getting the best of you and ended up getting away. Lovely. Do you really think that your fugitive came in here? I don't see any way out. I do. What am I missing? This. What's this? This globe seems to have been part of some mechanism. Huh. Um. Hold it. <laughs> Doesn't work. Seems like this came from a log. So we need a uh, 427 West. 42 North, 70 West. There must be a link with the Seaway map. Doesn't work. Okay. I must have missed something. Looks like the navigational paths described in the log. Mock up a journey. But the thing is, what's I got a sailor the sky layer can't okay, the sky layer, sorry. It's basically around the coast. So So am I supposed to follow the So what if I do this? Let's run this down real quick, sir. So it started off at dark water and went thirty three north. No, it's not. It's not red dot. Uh, that that's prodigal. The Orpheus. Cause I know I gotta figure out how does it end. Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh, hold a second. I'm an idiot. I got it. 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 
I was like, where did I? There must who, be a who, link who with the Seaway map. Okay, I got it. I got it. Okay, so they started at 42 north, 70 west. Then they went the 47. Um, what can I say? We sailed north all morning. Captain Hamilton is not confident. He says it will beat the office this season. My God, be, be merciful. Okay. So that, that was a race. So 47 north. 55 west. Probably when the world disappeared without, without, without trace. With these car, car, carcasses, we can no longer ignore their sad fate. What is eating these huge beasts? So, huh? 49 north, 61 west. So what if I follow 57 north, 51 west, 33 north, 53 west, Wait a minute. What boat is this? What ship is this? We've been in the office, return with empty scout the Skylight and the Hamilton are only our only memories. But wait a minute, so what's the one that looks like the navigational paths described in the log? Okay, so what if I do this? So I need 55... 42 north, that's, four, that's 42 north. Russian Empire, Europa, Center. Okay, that's 45. I need 42, so go down. And 70 north is right. Validate. <laughs> Doesn't work. I must have missed something. What have I missed? The Scylla. It's the boat that was stranded at the entrance to the harbor. Clearly, Charles Hawkins knew Captain Fitzroy very well. Okay. I wonder who the man with the glasses is in the photograph. Probably another friend of Hawkins. Oh, there's another. No, no, no that, that, that's the desk. Hmm. So what if I do this? If I do this, then go to 47 north, 55 west, up here. And this right here. <laughs> Doesn't work. Okay. I must have missed something. 49 north. Up a little more. 55. 61. 61. So it's back in this direction. <laughs> Doesn't work. I must have missed something. What am I missing? Then 50. What did I miss? I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> There must be a link with the Seaway map.
Oh Looks my like god, it. really? Well done, Pierce. I skipped to the last one because of this. I'll show you why. There must be a link. You with see the this? Map. You see how the, those brackets on this one for some odd reason? It's the most gorgeous. It's the most grotesque whale I've ever seen. Without eyes upon, it's still. That's the. <laughs> oh, it says I can imagine the scene of the fire revealed its secrets. Pierce off to Bradley, now on the trail of a survivor, and undertaking the search through the place, looking for proof. When a hooded man leaped into, into Sir Hawkins' workshop, there's still a panning detective, he was set off after him. By the following him into the office, Charles Hawkins, they discovered a secret passage piercing Bradley into the tunnel under the mansion. Mm. The secret passage under the manor. It's like a detective novel. That guy must have already gotten far. Yeah. And he had a direct means of entry to the crime scene. We must find him. Three seats. Do I really have to do this again? Uh, I'm going epic, y'all. Look. <laughs> Did Charles Hawkins use this place? Who were the others? Well, maybe. Okay, you might know this guy. What is this mask supposed to represent? Did Charles Hawkins hide something in this chest? Maybe. But we don't know one of them might be. I was like, can I look at it while I'm here? I can. Um, we're gonna go with hidden investigation, psychology, and while we're at it, influence. Yep. Okay, we'll go there. Um, but no, but um. Sorry. Uh, what, what can I, I, I can't see it. Okay, I can't, I can't see it. Is that Cthulhu? What the f- Why oh, is that the mask? That's weird. This piece of cloth is unmistakably from a dress. Was Sarah Hawkins here? Oh no! She found out! Ooh, about something! Oh, it's so cool! This padlock is too complicated for me. Can we get the cop here? Can we break the lock? Push him off. I don't know who to with you. I'm blind anyways, let's do it. I didn't do a great and I'm traveling all of this to you. Uh of course. And something tells me that the key is climbing these steps. There's tunnels all over this island. Given the size of this cave, there's got to be other entrances. The passage continues further down. Might as well start with that. I ain't gonna squeeze in there. I'll find another way. If possible, I prefer not to ruin my uniform. Really? Fine, fine. Me, baby. Go look for another entrance. I'll try my luck down below. Big baby. He don't want to mess up his uniform. 
He lacked the uniform today. His uniform is the greatest and most powerful being in the universe. Guys, do I have to die? Hello, housekeeping. It's housekeeping. I come to clean the cave out. Oh, what's that? These paintings must be several centuries old. Oh yeah, they are. This monstrous creature must be an allegory. Oh, it's a legit monster. Who wants to stick the tail right up your? Hey, how you doing? <laughs> oh, you fool. Mm. So everybody having a great evening. I'm wondering if he'll actually get in here because I don't trust the cop right now. Time has weakened these structures. So does that mean to go slow? Mm. What's this? I don't have time to search them all. Oh, you anyways, little punk. What's going on here? Shh. Piers. Keep your voice down. We're not alone. Good God. What have you got me into? Hey. You want to join, Let's buddy? See. I'll go on. Try to go down on your side. Yeah, th there's a passage. I'll meet you at the bottom. Cool. Well, it's a call, and we know it, so we're about to have fun, y'all. Find for the cult time. Jump off! Jump it off! Woo! I jumped off. I didn't jump off. No one can hear me. Hear me running. Hey guys! Guys, I want to finger my butthole. What the fudge? What the fudge? I want to finger my butthole. Come on, let's stick it in my finger in the butthole. Not nah, screw. I want the whole fist. This fist might. Ah! I'm going to. Ooh. What? Guys, guys, you see that right? Guys, guys, they got my picture. They got my picture, guys. A mass grave. Oh, that's the way to go. Oh God! I got, I got it. I can't breathe. Oh! What's happening? No, damn it! Find a way out of here. Okay. Okay, baby doll. It's okay, baby doll. That was quite easy to find a way out of here. That was quite easy to find a way out of here. He's panicking. He's a little baby. He's bubbling right now. Is it my turn? Yes. It is time. What? You will soon be one of us. If your body and mind are ready. I dream of it every night. I have constant visions. I am ready. He ready enough. to get fist up tail. Prove it to us. He wants to fist up his butthole. It's like in my dream. But it's not a dream, man. What's this? A pre-Columbian tribal dagger. 
Probably destined for scarification rituals. Okay. Can we take it? Use it for a for a weapon. I can't read Latin. Really? Can't read Latin? Was. Okay. Like always, y'all. So this door is unlocked. The others are, 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 are locked, but this one's locked. This one's locked, okay? Hey, what's Kafubu? What's Kafubu? You Wait, must I leave. Accept this plan. Ya Cthulhu Nithsiha Fitag. Ibithnk, Hapadk, Kutulu, Bithnko. Unis came back in Kutilabeo. Unneva Sebataya, Heaven, I own. You loig locked Kutulu loigna. Okay, so I think I'm back here. Guys, guys. Your Cthulhu Kasha. I guess I gotta go to the left. Cause I know I'm not supposed to go running out there. Can I take it? I don't think I should go out there. Obviously, I don't think I, don't think I should go out there. Cause if I go out there, they're gonna kill me. I, I feel him. That scared me. You are gifted indeed. Not another word. Let him pass through every part of you. All you sleep. We Bring me more of the sacred to the flesh. Of the earth. What the? It looks like a kind of deep coma. What could this ritual have done to them? We are ready for the ceremony. Oh, shoot. What uh, about your protege? His uh, awakening yeah. is complete. He will join you shortly. Who are you talking to? Okay. Okay. Just put it off. Oh, dang. It is put it off, but it's not put it off, put it off. They probably know I'm coming. Uh oh. We can bless Cthulhu in this chat. No, we're not converting. We're not dealing with Cthulhu. Not yet. Oh, we're not dealing with Cthulhu. Bradley, what are you doing here? I saw two odd-looking guys coming down. He's the cop. Seemed up to no good. He's the cop that gets killed. What in the world is this? He's foreseen this. An intruder! Oh shit! He has foreseen this! Don't move! Police! Don't move! Uh -oh. He's converting. I won't hesitate! Bradley, get Chris back! Hill, get back! You asked for it! That's, um. She foresaw it. You shouldn't have seen this. Ah! Oh my god. It's got in. I need 
to get out of here. It's all coming together, y'all. I, I, di I didn't make it. Or is it part of the game? Christian, no. Uh, my leg. Ooh, I'm trying to so much now. Oh, sorry. Man, I'm here. It'd be kind of funny if I, if I finish this in one sitting. That'd be kind of funny. But I don't think I, I don't think I will. Oh, somebody died, y'all. Oh, there actually is a butter there. Okay. So Charles became the embodiment of Cthulhu. Light. At last. You would hope it's like no. Nope. Oh, shout out to Fire, okay. Here's also Bradley followed the intruder to the secret meeting place called set in the network underground caves right under the Hawkins Manor. They witnessed a train ceremony led by Charles Hawkins, very much alive. Bradley tried to arrest him, but Hawkins, whose body displayed various mutations, disemboweled the police officer as he tried to escape from him. Pierce found, found a prisoner of a rock fall pushed to the roadside as he is in critical state. Dang! Woo! This is going so well! I love it! Look at that, the cosmos. Um, this goes so well. This goes so well, y'all. Hmm. Okay. Um, I forgot what I was gonna do. Oh. Really, come on. Okay, really? Wow, that's, just, that's not that long, but okay. What happened? I'm back, y'all. He's having a seizure. He will survive. Strong research. What's going on? There, he's opening his eyes. He saved him, Paula. I, I can't get up. Don't move, Pierce. You can certainly say that you gave us a scare. <laughs> what did you do to me? Undo these straps. Whoa, go easy, my friend. You were dead. He killed you. Are you sure he's better? Oh, he was he was dead. Me too, we, we were dead. What are you doing? I'm sorry, my friend. What, what the flip no. happened? Oh, now I'm gonna foozle. Extremely confused now. What did we not see? What happened to me? Okay, well, no, we're not last there, buddy. Where am I? In Santa Tana. <laughs> Mr. Sanders, you have to come with us. No, please. 
I can't leave here. Okay. You've got no choice, Sanders, and neither do we. You don't understand. <coughs> if I go out, he'll... <coughs> this foul gas again. I don't want him to find me. What am I doing? I'm so confused. Why? Wow, we're now in an alternate reality again. Dream world, everybody. I think this island doesn't exist anymore because unless you live here, you don't know nothing about it. Leviathan? And baby doll. Alright, buddy, you okay? Um. to know so I'm getting a feeling it's messing with my mind now what is to be honest is what happened because I now we're trying to figure out what is real and what isn't that's the question the cosmic is figuring out what when the lost rises up you will choose What? So basically, we're the catalyst. We're the main cause for what's going to happen. You there? Wake up! Come on, stand up. Oh man, thank you for the one. With the one bit. With the one time. bit. What? Can you stand up? Who are you? A friend of Ethan Bradley. It was he who told me that you had been interned here. Wait. Bradley is really alive? I don't understand. You filled me so full of drugs I can't distinguish dream from reality. Please believe that I have nothing to do with these disgraceful treatments. Look, I don't have time to explain everything. Okay. I'm not really supposed to be here. And the same goes for you, according to Ethan. You must leave as soon as possible. And as unobtrusively as possible. I brought you your clothes. Let me go ahead. We'll meet upstairs. Okay. Wait a minute. What's going on here? What do they do to the patients to make them so terrified? I would really like to know. I only see them when they are brought up for medical treatment. Okay. For problems they didn't have before going downstairs. Really? But this is neither the time nor the place to talk about that. We must not stay here. There are two men standing guard near the stairs. It's the only way to the floor above. Can I get a shot over I there? I should try to distract them and get at least one to come with me. All you need to do is to follow me as soon as the way is free. Understood. Gotcha. Can, can the guy stop crying over there? What does this mean? Well, wait, wait, we're trying to escape. We're going to re reconstruct the room. I love it. Am I in an asylum? Sarah. What did they inject him with? What did he write about the painting? 
that he can't see, I'm guessing. I don't. In his eyes, this symbol must have some protective virtues. I'm guessing. That one got that one. Which one am I, am I missing? There's another other. There. Sarah Hawkins is on this list of authorized visitors. Who the heck was she visiting? <laughs> you good, buddy? You can't, buddy. You still need to laugh a little bit now, man. You hysterical right now? Him, 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 might be. <laughs> ah, if you could be visiting any one of us. Okay, can I say If I don't get out of here, I'll end up like him. Laughing, laughing hysterically? <laughs> Poor wretch. Can I let him out? Damn. <laughs> to say that I'm surprised to see you, but we all know that your curiosity will be your ruin. I don't understand. These people need care. You keep them in this terrible place as if... Go back upstairs where your patients are waiting for you to treat them. Your patients are there waiting to treat them! As for you, gentlemen, do not disappoint me anymore. No one enters or leaves. Yes, Doctor. An enemy suspects suspects and presents white mom under the bear. I'll have to find a way of getting rid of those two myself. Can you shut up in there? I'm trying to tink. Gotcha. Cool. We can't be in there for too for, for too long. Cool. We can't be in there for too long, guys. Let's go. Apparently he's a claustrophobic guy. The machine is working again, but the control wheels haven't been put back on. I was just going to the storage room. I can bring them to you. No, Dr. Fuller doesn't want us touching the pressure valves. As you want. I'm gonna see if there are sleeping pills left. We run out really? again upstairs. Put a few aside for me, will ya? And above all, leave the wheels where they are. I saw nothing. What if I do this? Nope. Locked. Exactly what I need. So now I have to go that way. We're here today to do more than what we are to find a way out of the asylum. White. I think we got a walker. Oh, I got away! <laughs> oh, that punk little mother! Oh, I, 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 I did, did nothing. You heard nothing. You heard nothing. You heard nothing. You heard nothing. Getting rid of those two myself. The machine is working again, but the control wheels haven't been put back on. I was just going to the storage room. I can bring them to you. No, Doctor Fuller doesn't Dang. want us touching. I don't know the what they even got me with. As you want, I'm gonna see if they're sleeping. You, yeah, you there. Come here. Yeah, what do up? you want? Sleep. That's all. Sleep. You don't want to leave? Hmm. No. You seen the storm that's brewing? Fun flying here. Except for ah, one another bit, another bit. You want sleeping pills, right? Yeah. 
And in exchange, <gasps> I can make noise. Yes! Some noise. You'll draw the guards to your cell to allow me to escape. So, you in? Find yeah. something to make me sleep, and I'll take care of the guards for you. Gotcha. It's a deal. I'll find you some pills. Go look in the storage room. There must be sleeping <laughs> pills there. <laughs> he's gonna, he's gonna, he's gonna, he's gonna like, you're gonna grab you, drop him in, and like, hey, here's one more, here's you another. Just for the fun of it. <laughs> well, that's not the guy I need to take going around for. Well, um. Nothing there? Cool. You no, know, I was like, I'm changing something real quick. I have to change something real quick. It's time to me nuts. Uh, patrols. C does nothing, right? Okay, so I'm doing this. I'm changing this. I have to. Why? Yeah. Cool. Good. It's gonna be nuts with that. Finally, get that to work. Good God! What could this machine be used for? The patient seems to suffer from psychosis. He got out to his own. Oh wow! Really? This machine seems to consume a great deal of electricity. What will happen if I increase the current to the limit? Let's find out. The corpse is complete. Whose are these limbs? Is there a connection between this corpse and the machine? I don't know. I, I, that, that's hiding. Okay. Get out. I'm gonna do this. What's this? Have I activated anything? No, I haven't. I can still increase the load. Really? I can still increase the load. I can still increase the load. The fudge! It's an ammeter. I didn't expect to see one on this little rock. Vats of rotten flesh? An elaborate electrical system? Like a dumb pulp novel. Yeah. Worse and worse. Pretty much. Oh, we got some bits coming in. Oh, we got some bits pulling in. Woo, bit party, bit party. Okay, I'm good. Still increase the load. Okay, where? The liquid connects it to the electric current. What are its properties? That's the question you got. You got to figure out. But what? I, how do I change it to? What do I change? Yeah, but what do I change? Nothing else in this room, right? Oh, I missed something. Where's it at? It's on the ground? It's getting on the ground. It's up there. Do the cops know what's going on? Uh, what? Increase the load. I can still increase the load. How? Okay, what is the other?
No. Oh! I'm being dumb. I can figure that. Oh my god. It's done. Now for the others. We must not eat it. They must know that it is not good. Oh. It's a hidey hole. Okay. Really? Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. No, 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 not six. Four, five. There's a guard on here. Just got a few days to go. What is well enough inside me? I feel it in my head and in my body. He roars. me out. If I do not stop, he does not catch me. There's a guard right there. Exactly what I need. The key. But but ready? We're gonna lock it, y'all. This get padlock it? is too complicated for me. It's no use. Oh my god! Dude, you you ju you just tried. It's gray. What oh, pharmacy? I could do so much right now. Literally, I could have had this. Where do they keep their sleeping pills? I'll go take a look. No, you won't. 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 No. He's gone. I walked in front of him. He didn't see me. We got, what am I missing? The door is blocked on the other side. Oh. Got a walker. This way. Oh! They walked on a corner, you dirty. <clears throat> I love the Cthulhu in the background right here. Apparently, he wasn't blind to see a lantern. <laughs> don't tell me it. Oh, please, don't tell me. Oh! It saved right here. What? It's no use. The padlock won't give. Be some new doing. Nobody saw me. Okay, saved. Gotta get blind or something. They really gotta be blind. Or deaf. I gotta see to the farmers and get the pills. I think we gotta walk up. Oh, come on, man! You there. He opened the door after shutting the. He opened the door after shutting the door. Why? Well, at least it saved after I got the key. You didn't see nothing. Where do they keep their sleeping bells? Scopolamine, morphine, opium, nothing but common drugs. 
Got it. My new friend's sleeping pills. Ooh. Where's he going? That way. Don't turn this way yet. Oh! I'm just so <laughs> intriguing. Knock it open, open, then it will. Here, man. I've got what you want. Show me. There. And remember, they don't come for free. Don't you worry, you'll have your diversion. Go on now, go hide yourself. The crows, they're everywhere. These guys, I gotta get out of here. It's those guys I gotta diverge enough. Oh, the last one. Theoretically, I've only got one lever to push. The door is blocked on the other side. The green gas leaves from here and it runs through the whole building. The heck? I've had Rashina as best I can, however, the pipe makes them damaged. So, and I fear that the gas is, is, is escaping me. I cannot do any more in such a short time. All I can do is warn you if the equipment is put under too much stress, there is an explosion. Oh, wow. This valve controls the pressure. I'm raising it up, baby. Uh oh. It's impossible to break this chain with my bare hands. No, no, you, you got it, man. You got it, man. You got it. Where's the third one at? Oh, it's in here. The control wheel is missing. Can I borrow one of them up here? Did I lower it? I lowered it, didn't I? I'll take it. The valve's at this. I need, I need a... A thing to break that lock. Can I do it? Can I crack it? Nope. Can't do it. This padlock is too complicated. I was like, Jay, do I have, do I, do I have, 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 have any points? I have three. So what do I need? You know what? Give me two of these and this one. Cool. Can I do it? It's no use. Padlock won't give. I do instant cause significant damage to the infrastructure putting stuff to current concerns. It's unacceptable from from, from 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 now on the world. Stop with the gas in the storage room after Oh storage room, gotcha. It's no use. Padlock won't give. So how do we get into the storage room? This way. 
Nope. That's stuck on a wall! That's stuck on a... Man, what are you doing? You just staring me in my eyes? You want you... you do you want to kiss me? Okay, so it did save after I jacked that up. Okay. See, I got the last switch. I don't know why I don't do that switch thing. Use this control wheel to turn the valve I saw. Are you flipping kidding me? And never see in the life that I can. What hide. carnage? In this darkness, there's a light that I can Wow. All the levers are activated. You know what? You know what's funny? I have two of them active. I have two of them active. Like, I don't get how, like, it's like they give you all of this. And I could do two of them if I wanted to. So basically, which one should I do? Should I blow the place up? <laughs> or send high voltage electricity through the whole place? You know what? Let's do it. Blow it up. Let's do it. We got the blow up step. We're going to blow some... Yeah, it's gonna be an, an, an explosion, but it's not gonna be nothing too drastic. I know what I am. Blow me when I'm gone. You always accuse me of something that I don't see under my skin. Now for the next step. Light it up, mother. There we go. Now, I have to find one last thing I forgot about. You know what I forgot? It's impossible to break this chain with my bare hands. Fine, I will send an ele electrical search to the whole place. I think I mean, what, what, how the heck I found that spot. He saw me. <laughs> Always be there. Blow me when I'm gone. Oh, they're all up lighting. Ready to go? That should draw the attention of the guards. I should hide. Damn it! What's going on? Is that gonna help me out? Okay. Oh, there's one here. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Oh, what's in there? What's going on here? You? Don't you worry about the doctor. Right now, he'll have plenty to keep him busy with his precious machine. It gives us time to get away. I'll undo you. Get away? Get away where? I, I can't go anywhere. It'll find me like it found me here. Really? You're mistaken about the beast. Don't stay with me, or you'll end up the same way. You're Sanders, aren't you? I heard you from myself. What did they do to you? What does Fuller want with you? The 
doctor. You think it's the doctor who scares me? Ah, uh, who scares you? The doctor wants to heal me. But he's the one who's crazy. He wants to restore my sight. He wants to give me back my eyes. And yet I told him that I didn't want him. I do not want to see it anymore. Really? The real culprit is Sarah. Her and her accursed paintings. You're kidding me. You're talking about Sarah Hawkins. <laughs> the one and only. Really? The legendary. Oh. There is no artist more enlightened or cursed than Sarah Hawkins. In her office, I saw signs of a ritual, perhaps an invocation. These things, that's what makes you say she's cursed. You're wrong. It was not an invocation, but a revocation. What? <laughs> but she failed. And that's what counts. Really? What's going on on this island? I'm... I'm so sorry. That we should never have met. What are you talking about? Destiny! It has trapped you. Don't let it see you, or you won't be able to escape it. Don't look at it. That's how it finds you. What finds me? Sarah Hawkins visitor. The Shambler. Sanders, pull yourself together. What? Without her, it's no longer possible to save me. What? No! Sanders. Oh, what the? F oh, God. oh, my God. I got it. This is insane. What killed him? I want to know that, too. to walk into right down <coughs> the gas oh what this my is... head later this is fine. we need to move on <laughs> what the Pierce woke up in an asylum stall in the cellars of the Riverside Institute he met Dr. Colden a female friend of Bradley who helped him escape Wandering through the corridors of the place where Dr. Fuller reigns supreme, Pierce was able to talk to a man called Francis before dying in a full view of the fact he accused the argument of being the cause of this torment. Pierce finally left the cursed building, come to a Bradley called the couple of cabbages, including his cousin, he died out. Inside of that, I'm gonna go. Oh my god. I know, I don't, I don't want to look! Why you make why you make why you making me look? I don't want to look. Casulo, why you be so rude, man? No means no, Casulo. That nightmare again. I need a drink. Nah, we don't need we don't need a drink. But like I said, of course you know before you no. realize. I want to know what Bradley and Dr. Colden have to say about all this. You're awake, Mr. Pierce. How do you feel? Hangover. Did I sleep long? The day is only starting. It's fine. That's not her. How's our fugitive? Dr. Fuller hasn't reported your disappearance to the force, but that'll come soon. Really? Bradley? Who else would it be? Mr. Pierce, are you all right? You look like you saw a ghost. I did. I... Th there are things I, I can't explain. Tell us. What happened? I'm, I'm gonna be honest. I'm not an expert on the occult yet, so yeah.
Given the energy he pours into Riverside, I presume it was fullest creation. His father's, to be correct. Okay. He was a surgeon on board the Scylla. He founded the hospital in 1904 with funds from the Hawkins family before he died and his son Thomas Fuller took over. Okay. Two families inextricably linked. Most island families are that way. Captain Fitzroy's father was also a seaman aboard the Scylla. Powerful families dominating everything. Yes. And as you could tell, Dr. Fuller is like some crazed emperor. Okay. He wouldn't be happy if he knew we were snooping around. No, I wouldn't. I know the risks. I don't fear him. Do you okay. wish to know anything else? Yeah, um... Dr. Fuller seems to be leaving a trail of corpses. Not to mention those strange machines, chains, and tools of all kind. Yes. I've been telling you that Fuller uses his patients as guinea pigs. Mm -hmm. What I saw was more akin to torture than medicine. Do you even hear what you're saying? Dr. Fuller is highly respected. It's the truth, Ethan. And I'll prove it to you. I'm listening, Mr. Pierce. Come back. Okay. What I'm sure of now is that the Hawkins case isn't just an accident. And what brings you to that conclusion? Yeah. The fact that Charles Hawkins survived the fire. I don't understand. Mr. Hawkins was buried. That's what he would have you believe. Mm -hmm. I have a hard time believing you. You were there, Bradley. You even opened fire on him. I'd remember that. Why would he fake his own death? Do you think he covered up his wife's murder? I don't know. That's possible. It seems hard to swallow. Don't you have anything more concrete, Pierce? Um... I found this. I found a dark water PD badge. Lost a colleague recently? What the... Bradley. Ethan? I'm all right. I just had a... That's gone. You're sure? If it's important, it'll come back. But I can't explain why Dr. Fuller would have that badge. Yes. The man's a danger, believe me. What can we do, Pierce? Bradley, what do you remember? I don't understand your question. The night we went into the Hawkins mansion, you don't seem to remember the tunnels and what occurred there. Yeah. Uh, no memory of going down any tunnel. No, we were in the manor, then... Uh... Then what? Oh. I, uh... The rest is quite blurry. I don't recall how I came back home. And then? I went to visit you at the hospital. And called on Marie's help to get you released. And you don't remember the events of the tunnel? I don't. Let's talk about something else. Um, did she just hop up? She just, she popped up. Like, what the? I have flashbacks. They haunt me. What did they do to you? There was that doctor, Fuller, and a nurse. Blood everywhere. My legs, the pain, I, I couldn't bear it. I was screaming. They injected me with something. I woke up at the Institute. Bradley was there. And how you scared us. You seemed... demented. Mm -hmm. You likely woke up during the anesthesia. No wonder those memories haunt you. What in God's name were they doing to you? What happened afterwards? When I woke up the second time, I was in a padded cell. That's where you found me, Doctor. After you released me, I got a good look at what's in store for the patients of the Riverside Institute. I did. Hallucinogenic gas pumped into the cells. An infernal machine. Horrific medical experiments. Yep. Impossible. Dr. Fuller would never do such a thing. You should believe it, Ethan. What Mr. Pierce saw is precisely what I've been trying to prove. Did you discover anything else? Um... I heard you talking earlier. 
Why am I not surprised? I get the impression you two don't get along. Intrusive and not very clever. Mm -hmm. Anyway, let's get back to the business at hand. Okay. See, I'm not a medical professor, so I can't say I should be dead. You should be dead. It kind of sucks that I can't do nothing with it. Can I do nothing? Can I do nothing? Can I do nothing? No, okay. Well, let's go back. I can't do nothing with that. Tom. I, I met a Francis Sanders. You know him. Of course. He's a patient. Or was. I haven't seen him since Dr. Fuller had him transferred to the basement. He knew Sarah Hawkins. And that's what killed him. What? How did he die? I'm not sure I can explain it. Tell me how Mr. Sanders died. Um... I didn't see what, but something was there with us. Of what do you speak? Sanders said it was Sarah Hawkins' visitor. He spoke of it like a living being. Ooh. Sarah Hawkins? Have I missed something here? This makes no sense. I don't see how it can help crack the Hawkins case. You really think she's involved? How could she have murdered Mr. Sanders? Francis Sanders mentioned Mrs. Hawkins just before dying. It's no coincidence. You know, Francis Sanders was a well-known art collector. I guess you can still pay a visit to his wife, Irene Sanders. That's good, we'll do that. An art collector, you say? That's probably how they met. If you plan on having dinner at the Sanders household, please spare the widow the tale of her late husband's suffering. I don't agree. She deserves the truth. But that truth may be biased. We don't know the bottom of it. Okay, everybody. Uh, must be prudent or better to current. I think... Well, we, we don't have to tell her the full details because her husband is dead, that he passed away. But see, the thing is, the way, the way, the way they're playing it is that we're basically just going to go straight in there and go, and not, and tell her every single little detail. We don't have to do that. We're just going to say he passed away, he died. He's done. I mean, I'm sorry. You know what? I'm going to go with the truth. She He's you. right. We can't ignore the truth. But it could drive her mad. Better madness than ignorance. Very well. Uh -oh. I'll go to see Francis's widow. Perhaps I'll find a link between her husband's death and Sarah Hawkins. Don't end up in the hospital this time. <laughs> I'll do my best. I think we'll all do our best. What's up, Christopher? Let us go now and learn the truth about what's happening on this island. That's true. The other night's events are still confused in my head. Gotcha. Okay. Um. I think I'm gonna. I'm gonna call it right there because I I wasn't supposed to be getting any crazy, crazy far into that. It's a little earlier than I was than I was expecting. Maybe fi maybe five fifteen minutes earlier. We had that little hiccup. I, I kind of rebounded from that a little bit. But we're gonna call it that. We're gonna call it at the end of a moment. At the end of a time. Before we, before we go talk to Irene Sanders, we're going to take a moment and, re and recollect on what, what we've experienced. But yeah, no, I'm going to get off it now. i got to get my mind and body back and ready for the tomorrow's events. So yeah, so for tomorrow, <coughs> hopefully it will work. Oh my god. Other than that, thank you so much for watching this, guys. Thank you so much for watching this. Hope you guys enjoyed this. If you guys enjoy this, hit that follow button on Twitch. Other than that, my friends, thanks so much for watching. You guys should have a great night. Even better now. Wins always have fun. Slow and peace I'll see you on the next one. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Cthulhu will see you in your dreams. <laughs>